Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're going to be doing well today. Um, I don't know why I said that. Let me vlog in today. I thought I would do a vlog in between, you know the days after Christmas and before New Year's, like them days, are like my favourite days of the year. So I thought let's vlog on one of them. Me and my sister are going to Blue Water today. We have some Christmas money to spend. So just feel like doing a bit of shopping, which is a bit greedy since I've literally, it's just been Christmas and I've got presents, but I don't know. I just feel like buying some makeup, but I don't know, I might not buy anything at all, but yeah, I'm popping to the shops today and I just thought I would film it and I did say in my what I got for Christmas video that I might do like a haul of what I buy, so I thought, oh, if I just do like a vlog and then I can show you like what Maria buys, if I buy anything, um, just take it on the day with you really, and then once I get home, like I'm just literally going to be chilling, um, that's all I've been doing really, but I actually wanted to get up early today to do some makeup, but um, Woke up too late. I haven't been able to get up, I think, because I'm ill. But still with this cold flu thing. Um, I just haven't been able to get up in the morning. I wanted to get up at like 7 and I got up at... Gone 8 and now we need to leave. So I've got no makeup on, which is a bit annoying. But I didn't want to wear today, so I just put on this big leather jacket from Rocket. Just a black roll neck jumper. Um, crossbody bag, leggings and some trainers. Yeah, I don't know. This, this outfit's a bit weird, but... Oh, I don't know. I've got literally no energy. Like, this flow it is killing me. Well, it's not. It's just like hanging on. Like, you know, every day you wake up, it's like, I've still got it. I feel dead inside. <laughs> okay, we're here. We are here. I'm actually embarrassed to tell you guys because we're literally one of them people that <laughs> people slag off because we're literally like, to be fair, it's the 20, what's the date? The 28th. So it's not like Boxing Day, but we are, it is It is five to nine. I'm embarrassed to say, but it's five to nine because we just thought it's going to be so busy. We'd rather just get there when they open. They open at nine, get a few bits and then just go home and be home by like lunchtime, probably earlier. Um, like we're literally going to be here for like an hour and a half, aren't we? Yeah. So we are being one of them people, but uh, yeah. <laughs> now, it's just like, season. I don't think it's going to be that really busy. Done. Like, I just feel there's quite a lot of people coming in, but it's not like we want any sales stuff. Like, I literally just want to buy some makeup and just treat myself because for some reason, Christmas time, when I get like gifts and things, I makes me want to buy more. Like, why is that? So, Harry, we might come a little bit too early because there's nobody here and then they're open. Actually, that one's open, huh? But I think we might have come a bit too early. Guys, we're finished and it is 11.35. So yeah, we literally just got in and got out. Um, we had a Chinese at, what time did we sit down? 11 o'clock. We had the Chinese, but I just really fancied it and I was actually gonna order a Chinese takeout the other night. But I feel like when you order it for yourself, you end up spending like 20 quid, but that was eight pound for the box and a drink. So I don't think that's that bad. And we've still got some leftovers, which I'll probably eat. Oh my God. Oh, don't up in there. Um, which I'll probably eat later. Really? I'll do you a little haul when um, I get home. I didn't really get anything to be fair. I'm like, you know, when you're just not really in that mood to part with your money. Like, I just, I don't know. I don't know what I want. I don't, I don't need anything. It's literally been Christmas. I don't need anything. That's why. Like, I didn't even know what to ask for, for Christmas. So yeah, I didn't really buy anything. But I'll show you the few things that I picked up, and also Maria picked up quite a few bits. So I'll, Maria can do a haul as well. Would you just do a haul? Oh, just say no. We'll do it a whole later, don't worry guys. Um, I just actually remembered that I wanted to look for a nude lipstick. I just wanted to have a look in the shop because I feel like it's hard to order lipsticks online. Um, so I wanted to order a lipstick in, no, what? I wanted to look for a nude lipstick in the shop. I just wanted, I don't know, I feel like I haven't had that perfect nude. Um, but I forgot, so yeah. So I'm back from the shops. I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. But my um, Anna Louisa package came today, so I wanted to show you Anna Louisa pieces I picked up from the website. This part of the video is really kindly sponsored by Anna Louisa. I've worked with them quite a few times now and I just love them. So I picked up a necklace and this is actually a Taurus necklace. Obviously you can get whatever star sign you are, but it has a little engraved ball and I just thought it was really cool. I'm not super into star signs. I mean, obviously if you are, this is like the perfect gift. But I just thought it was a really cool necklace. I really like the thin um, chain. I like the square gold bar. And then with the ball engraved on it, I just thought it would look really nice. I think it'll look really nice, like, stacked as well um, with other necklaces. But I just thought it was a really cool 
little necklace so i'm gonna put that on now i always say in my videos how much i love anna louisa and their quality like especially because obviously i wear mainly gold um jewelry the gold is always such a lovely like shade of gold i don't know if that sounds silly but i feel like sometimes the golds can be too yellow or like not gold enough it's just the perfect like really good quality looking gold they last really well and i just love how delicate this chain is with the like little tag and that's really cute so this is my taurus what is that on my nose is that a spot i don't know this is my taurus star sign necklace i just think that looks really nice i'm really happy with that i just love how thin the chain is as well i think that looks really nice um and then i also picked up some rings picked up this like chunky gold ring i just really like plain sort of rings because i like to wear a lot of gold rings i think the plainer ones just look really nice stacked with other ones you can wear them on their own they're just quite simple and timeless and i just love the plainness of this and also the thickness of it i think this would look really nice on like the middle um finger also with anna louisa they are affordable as well they are a little bit more of a luxury jewelry piece but they're not luxury to the point where you're like breaking the bank so if you want jewelry that looks better quality i feel like anna louisa is a really good place to go i think that just looks really nice and simple um on the middle finger i'm really happy with that and then i picked up one more ring as well because like i said rings are definitely my favorite and if you ever see me wearing a ring it's probably from anna louisa it's really all i wear like i said i just think they're really great quality um, and also affordable as well i got this one which oh i'm gonna say this is my favorite it has this like square print design through it like cut out i just love this ring i think it looks really expensive on trend and also with this one which is quite good is it's adjustable so you don't have to if you're not sure of your ring size or i don't know if you want to change up what finger that you wear it on this one is adjustable you can just pull it to make it bigger and then obviously squeeze it together to make it thinner yeah, i think it looks really cool i'm obsessed with them. my two new rings and then also my gold necklace as well i love these pieces i'm so happy with them also really exciting as well they are running a huge sale right now um so i will link their website in the description box because they are offering 10 percent off of last chance items and also and some of their other items on the website are up to 60 percent off so you can get a really good saving if you've been wanting to try anna louisa or if you've been wanting to find a nicer quality jewelry just want to try it out i definitely recommend trying it now you can get some money off see how the quality is like and i mean you can just get a great saving so really really recommend that like i said i will link it in the description box if you are interested but yeah i just wanted to show you my new pieces i'm absolutely obsessed with them i'm definitely like a gold jewelry gal um and yeah i'm really happy with them so thank you so much to anna louisa for sending me these items i'm also going to show you what i picked up from the shops earlier so like i said not very exciting but i just picked up some um literally look at how much chocolate i'm eating it's everywhere um chocolate what metic pads take my makeup off um also picked up this micellar water because i really needed some more but i i only got the big one uh, and then i picked up this benefit brow setter um i basically needed a new brow gel and i feel like benefits ones are really raved about but i didn't want to buy the big one so i just this is like a mini 12 pound brow gel so i thought i'd give that a go um i bought a new real technique sponge because if you watch my what i got for christmas video i did get some new like cream liquid products so i thought i'd get a new sponge for it um and then lastly i picked up the nars um smudge proof eyeshadow primer because i don't really wear tons of eyeshadow i mainly just wear like a brown all over my lid and my crease but because i've got really oily eyelids i just find my eyelids look really oily really quickly and I don't know i feel like the bronzer or whatever i put on my eyelid could last a little longer and this are really good reviews like i said it's the nars um i don't know why i think we'll focus the nars smudge proof eyeshadow base so i thought i'd give that a go see if it helps like control my oils and everything so yeah that's what i picked up today at blue water and then obviously we had a chinese as well Oop. maria's just in the shower and then i'm gonna let us show you what she picked up because she was quite excited with what she picked up and then i'm going to i'm going to get ready now because i'm going to film a boohoo haul film a boohoo haul and then i'm going to chill um even though i've done a lot of chilling these past few days but i'm really enjoying it i'm not gonna lie i need to put away that my you can see that my presents i filmed what i got for christmas they're just all on the desk and i really just sort them out but i don't have any room like oh got no room for anything it's literally dry, like, stressing me out i've got no room for anything i just um cleaned some of my makeup and just re put it like back in my bag because this stuff honestly gets so dirty i don't know how it gets so filthy so i just kind of cleaned 
didn't do the best job but I just kind of cleaned over some of the makeup just so it's a bit more fresh so we're just going to put some makeup on because I, I'm going to film a boohoo haul even though I still feel really rough with this cold so using like a whole face of warm sun you don't mix it or I just mixed it what do you mix it with the lighter one this one 30, 30. Maria's going to be using some new makeup she got for Christmas. I got her this Fenty lip gloss for Christmas. And the gloss bomb in Sweet Mouth. I thought, wait, did I buy? I thought, oh, I don't know. I bought her that. And my mum got her this lipstick. That lipstick in Cherish. My camera's not focusing at all. And then also I told my mum about this Charlotte Tilbury face powder. So my mum got it for my sister as well. I love new makeup, like even though I feel like makeup's something that I don't like to spend my money on, but when I'm in the mood, I'm like, I want to get all new makeup, uh -huh. like, I want everything to be fresh. That's what I feel like to do. Could have done with a new, like, cream bronze product, actually. I should have got the one from Fenty, but oh well. To be fair, if I'm going to get the one from Fenty, I might as well order it because Boots are doing 3% off. Mm. It's £12 on the website right now. Yeah, so I'm not, I'm not saying but that no, much. I wanted to just Where's the lid? What is wrong with you? Oops. That is literally you summed up. Who puts it back in the box and does it? I didn't realise. Oh, it's cute, isn't it? A little mini one. Mm -hmm, I like it. Yeah, I might have to give that purchase. Why actually. people have this argument? Like, how good actually are? Like, how are they even worth it? Like, how much can they actually do? Do you remember? Like, that was like what like, primers? Yeah, like they even work. Like, they even even any Yeah, I don't. Like, so how good is it actually going to be? I, I don't, don't know. know. But like you guys aren't really going to be able to see, but I just used the Charlotte Tilbury contour wand. I'm going to use the blush, because I want to show you guys this blush. Honestly, if you can get your ha hands, if you can get your hands, if, if you get your hands on the high blush in Pinkgasm, I just realised it's called Pinkgasm. What's the... Oh, the nice one's called Orgasm. Do you think cap uh, cap Why can't I speak? She has a bit I can't find the blush I need. What blush are you using again? Brush, I mean. Um, so brush. Oh, you're going to use your new brush that you want to say? This, is, this needs to be washed. I know, apparently Laura Mercier powder is not all that it's cracked up to be. Oh, I'm not really an expert in the field, and this is how long, like, when I actually did get into it, and what was good at the time, that's how long ago it was that Laura Mercier was, like, the trending. Yeah, it was, like, and that's why I have this, but, yeah, it's not, there's not Laura Mercier. I'm using the YSL... Souffle de glace. How much is that? Is that for your under eye and stuff? Yeah, to be fair, I never really use it unless I wear foundation, but I never wear foundation anymore, like at all. So I bought it for like glam makeup, but I literally never wear it. So I'm like, why did I buy it? So I'm good. I'm starting using it like in my T zone, mm -hmm. even just like my normal makeup stuff. Otherwise, what's the point of me buying it? Yeah, exactly. Right. Megan? Yeah. Oh, use your new powder. Yeah, Choose a new shot to wear powder, guys. I do feel like Charlotte Tilbury's the hype thing. Yeah, right the hype thing. Right because it never was. I think I bought you a lipstick from Charlotte Tilbury. Obviously, on you. No, own. you bought me a Chanel one. I bought you a Charlotte Oh no, yeah, you Tilbury. did. Yeah, you did. And you were like, oh. like it wasn't. No, cool I did. Then. Yeah, it was. No, you got me like quite a dark pink. For some reason, you have this thing of doing. That. I remember when you came home. Bless your heart. You bought me that Chanel lipstick. Did I buy you you ran to me, came home, and like you bought me Chanel lips. I don't know why. This was like literally like five years ago. But you bought me like a dark pink. Did I? Like a fuchsia dark pink. And then the. Uh, I don't remember buying you, ever buying you a Chanel. Why? Yeah, would I, I don't know. Chanel? I think maybe I'd bought you something, and like you just ran. I think you had money for some reason. You can't, You bought me a Chanel lipstick. Oh, hello. And then, yeah, it was like a dark fuchsia pink. <laughs> and then. Did um, you wear it? No. Yeah. I still got it though. I didn't. I had never chucked it because obviously. I just didn't want to chuck it, but I don't um, ever remember even going into Chanel and buying a lipstick. <laughs> so I'm not that offended. I've lost my Charlotte Tilbury powder. Like, I actually have. I can't find it. Show me that one. No, seriously, I couldn't find it yesterday. No, seriously. Maria's got a new lip combo on. What are we thinking? You happy with it? <laughs> you happy with it? Yeah. What are you wearing? On my lips. Yeah. Cherish from my Cherish. <laughs> you know it's all, it's awkward when you're filming me, so I can't see oh, myself. Oh, okay, well, there you go. Cherish from Mac, and oh, can you not do this when um? You look fine. Oh, your eyebrows look really nice. I really like how you've done the. Yeah, 
I need to get the full size of that um, brow gel, I think. This is Cherish from MAC and Fenty lip gloss. You change, change. Sorry? <laughs> Am shade 4. Shade 4. I keep calling it shade 4. Sweet I don't even know what it's called. It's called Sweet Mouth. So I'm ready now, guys. I've done my makeup. Obsessed with this make um Yeah, this makeup look. This lip that I've done. It's more new than I would usually go for. I don't know if you can see, but I'm literally obsessed with it. Um, if you are interested, it is Kylie Lip Liner in Kylie. My new like favourite lip liner ever. It's so nice. Um, then it is a mixture of two lipsticks, it's MAC Cherish and Charlotte Tilbury lipstick in Kim KW. It's like two perfect nudes mixed together and then the gloss, this is the gloss that I got Maria for Christmas. It's the Fenty Beauty Gloss, um, but I got it in the shade, I need to whiten my teeth. Um, I got it in the shade, what shade did I get it in? Sweet Mouth. I feel like Fenty Glow is what people wear, but oh my god I'm obsessed with this colour, I'm going to go buy that lip gloss straight away and they're doing 20% off on boots right now so I think I'm gonna go buy that. I'm just really into makeup at the minute and I just want to keep buying makeup stuff. Oh I also ordered Look Fantastic are doing a sale on their website and I just ordered a moisturizer and some tanning drops. I need to stop spending money. Oh no stop. Right I'm gonna go film a boohoo haul and then we're gonna chill and just do nothing and eat. That we're having leftover like meats and mash and pickles and stuff for dinner so very excited about that. I've honestly been playing Sims for like hours. I started playing The Sims 4, which I've never really played before. And anyway, hours just went by and I don't know. But what I'm going to do now is basically the tips of my hair have gone light, like the tips of my extensions. I don't know why it does this, it really irritates me because I like my hair to be dark. So, anyway, my hair lady said to just use like a root touch up on the ends. So that's what I'm gonna do. I just bought this Clarol um, dark brown root touch up. I'm gonna try and like run it through the ends of my hair. I don't know, but all I know is that I'm just desperate to not have light ends because I just don't like how it looks. Like it just, I don't know. My hair is so greasy, I'm gonna wash it after this. Okay, <laughs> it rained early. I took the dog out and it rained and yeah, my hair's gone frizzy. But I don't know if I should have just got a normal dye. Like, the root touch-up seems a bit awkward. Take me out to So I remembered that I didn't show you Maria's shopping haul. Just want to show what you got from the shop today. From Urban Outfits, <laughs> I got this. How do you say it? I don't yes. actually know. I think it's, yes. Yeah, it's Franz. I literally don't know. And um, do you know like when you're like, oh yeah, that's okay, but when you actually buy it, I'm like, oh wow, this is really sick. I yeah, like I wish I, I really wish I got it, you know. It's really tight, I really like that. I wish I'd have got it. And they've got a different, like, they've got her greeny colour. Now the packaging, so I already used it, but brand new beauty blender. I'm quite. Snap. I'm kind of like wishing though that I got the the actual beauty blender. This oh really? The, yeah. I'm more like I just wish I splurged and had like. Well, to be fair, you still could because that was only six quid. It's not like you have yeah. made like a big purchase, so you can't really. I guess. But I think it's seventeen pound. Actually, do you know what? I reckon it's cheaper. Like on Beauty Bay, I don't think it is seventeen pound on Beauty Bay. Like Maybe let's have a look. Um, I got the Fenty Beauty Primer. This is this True Matte one because there's like three different types, but I've only got the little one. There was only a bunch of stock. Think but I want to get that, you know. I'm a little one though, because I want to try it first. Yeah, because it's, like it's a lot of money to buy like a big one, and you don't know if you're gonna like it. Like, so sick. Like, yeah, really her packaging like it. is really cool. That, and I think it worked properly yesterday, but you never know. Like, I don't know if they do anything. Who knows? <laughs> I'm just happy to not use the Nivea. <laughs> Maria's had the Nivea, but you know when everyone used Nivea Post Shave Balm, she's had this Nivea Post Shave Balm works. for about five years and still like used it on her face. Like powder brush because I got the Charlotte Tilbury powder mm -hmm. and I didn't want to use a disgusting brush. So Wait, was this. that brush alright? Yeah. Mm. I think so because I just didn't want to like. I already got one of those fit. You know the big. Yeah. Brushes, but, like and I wanted one that's more. The T zone. But that's not really, really exciting because I'm just repetitive, but it's the Maybelline Superstay that I use. And then I bought from MAC the highlight, which was quite expensive. Bit of splurge, I'd say. It was a splurge, it was £27. But I think it's so worth it because like, I don't, that's going to last Yeah, and when now. you had like, it on earlier, it was like the perfect highlight for you, don't you think? Because all my highlights smashed. Yeah, and I, yeah, that's, it's quite like, wait, should we do a little top juice watch? 
Oh, okay. Wow, it's not focused. It's quite dark. In oh here. my god, it's really nice. Yeah. Perfect shade. 10 out of 10. Oh, we didn't really I feel like I bought so much water. I felt like I was completely like. I don't know. I kept having like the nationwide app. Um, <laughs> and and yeah, it, like, it so comes up. It kept coming up, and I was like, oh, Well, I God. guess you got like. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, successful day. Okay, guys, I'm going to end off this vlog here. I've just. My hair's really frizzy, but the uh, root. Wait, what did I use? That root tip thing. Root thing, I think, worked. I mean, to be fair, in the light, and it looks like my hair's light and then goes to dark. <laughs> So I'm hoping in actual daylight it's fine. It might just be because that light's shining and like picking up the, I don't know. I don't know, but I think it worked. In the mirrors and stuff, it, I, it looked like it worked, but it is kind of late, so the lighting's not great. So hopefully that worked because it was just, I got it on my neck. Um, it was really irritating me, the light ends. But yeah, I don't know if this vlog was very interesting. Like, oh, I need to get that off. I just wanted to vlog one of the days in between Christmas and New Year. Like a little bit of shopping, just chilling in the house and stuff. Um, I think I'm just going to watch a movie now and go to sleep. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Please make sure to give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy. And also don't forget to check out the Anna Louisa website and their sale right now. I'll link it in the description box below. Um, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next one. Bye.